Hey everyone, and welcome back to episode 522 of Fallout 4. The last episode, we came to Green Top Nursery, started to work on the settlement, because I totally have been neglecting this place for a very long time. I also neglected to turn in the quest to get this place <laughs> for a very long time, so I've barely been here, and uh, they're already at 17 people. They have no beds. They have, they basically have nothing. This is this this is this settlement at its like lowest form. Minus the fact that I spent the last episode, of course, adding stuff to it. Um, I broke down the old building that was over. Can you read that vine? Fine. Okay. Don't accidentally delete the whole place. I uh, broke down the crappy building here and I put uh, a nice square building, because that's what I'm notorious for, very square buildings. But hey, they're, they're, they're structurally sound. They look half decent. They're pretty functional. But uh, I made a first floor. I'm going to move like cooking stations and hit you you shoot shoot no 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 don't don't assign him to the camp station no you get away from the camp station I'm, I'm gonna make like cooking stations and things like that which you know what I'm sorry dude <laughs> I kind of stole that from you but I but I don't want to use it I want to use the fancy one uh, I'm gonna put the fancy one in the corner so we're gonna put chem stations um, weapons workbench armors workbench all my all my workbenches and things like that on the bottom floor we're gonna make this place look kind of pretty. So, armor workbench. Mm, I can even put you uh, like a bit of an angle, just because it looks fancy schmancy. Cooking station. We always do cooking stoves. It's supposed to be my crafting center. Uh, I usually put my power armor station up top, kind of thing. But I'm gonna just slap it down right there. Weapons workbench. I gotta get some lights in here. All these nuka mixers I haven't even messed with yet. Cages. Look, got some lookup fields because you know the game's flawless. Oh, that's right. I should totally put the shops in here. I kind of overlooked that for a second. Let's give these people some jobs. All right, yeah. So stores, trader. Uh, only only be putting emporiums here. Produces income based on the total population. Makes the settlements happier. That dude standing inside of a wall. It's freaking me out. <laughs> Just a, a normal day in Fallout. Uh, yep. So, that's kind of straight, isn't it? That's pretty decent. I'm, I'm a bit proud of myself on that one. But yeah, let's let's totally put shops and things on the first floor. I forgot about that. I'll put all, like, all the beds and stuff up top. So, armor. Mm, you can beat... Nah, behind the window is not really safe. If you have your back to a window and someone comes up behind you and just shoots you, that's not safe. Granted, they can still just shoot you from there, but eh. I thought about your safety a little bit. You should you should respect that. Ooh, just a touch. Uh, weapons person right before we go up the stairs. Eh, why not? This weapons person is also going to have their back to a window. So you know what? We're just going to pretend that there's no windows in here. And that the turrets are enough to defend everybody from everything bad. Food and drink. Food and drink's good for happiness. But it's not really a necessity. But again, what it is is an entire extra thing to sell to an entire extra store. That is about as crooked as your butt crack. Let's uh, fix that one. No crooked cracks here. Um. Mm, here. When you're cooking, you want to look out the window. Because then it's nice and pretty. So I'll put that there. Um. Maybe I will put you up top. We'll see. I want to put basically all my shops stuff down here. I feel like that's the smart decision because of the pathfinding issues that NPCs always have. But also because, like... You're always on the first floor anyway. I'm going to come to the building and it's going to be the first floor that I see. Because it's the first floor. <laughs> Put you a bit closer to the wall. Um, you know, I might as well line you guys up with the lines on the floor. The person can fit back here just fine. And the NPC should teleport. So line that up. You are lined up pretty decently with that already. And how's this one? I think that might be good. No. No, <laughs> no, not yet. Okay, you're you're good. But yeah, I'll keep saying it because I'm sure people keep will keep asking. I don't know why I sound miserable. It's it's a uh, it's spring. It's allergy season for me, so I'm kind of miserable right now. And I ugh, that ain't fun. I'll sneeze a lot. I'll probably mute my mic a lot and sneeze and things like that. It's just ah, uh, it's not my time of the year. It's why I like winter so much because everything is like not everything's dead. There's no plants. There's no pollen. Everything's just gone. I'm happy. It's cold. I like, I like cold weather. I don't need you. 
Uh, I do need a drink. My AP is in the toilet. <laughs> my, might as well. It's uh, it's easy peasy. I need the power armor, but let's start reassigning some people. Oh hey, was I able to get rid of that? No. No, I can't get rid of that. Properly hydrated. Great. You. No job. Come over here, man. You're gonna be one of our new shop peeps. Which shop keep do you want to be? You can be... You can be our bar dude. You can be our bartender. Hey, lady who's stuck on the wall. You okay. seem to be fond of the general store. You're going to walk toward the general store now? What would you look at that? I'm surprised. I thought you were stuck. Um, then I just assign you to a job. Get your ass over there. What you doing, man? Uh, you don't have a job. Oh, oh, not, your, your job is to troll me. Standing in the doorway. So the guy I have selected is the dude who keeps being on, or keeps sitting on the cooking place and the drug place. So clearly, I'm gonna assign you to weapons because you're, you're you're totally you're totally uh, okay. I don't know, sane. You're of sound mind and body. Nah, I'm setting this up for failure. So every place has a person. Good. So all the shops are manned. That's awesome. Still want to put lights in here. This power armor station, maybe I'd put it in the corner. That'd be kind of nifty. I'll put it in the corner. So this is the top floor, second floor. It's gonna be one big fat bedroom, I think. I think that's, I think that's good. There's not really anything I need to put up here in particular. And then I want to close it off and maybe put a roof on it. We'll see. I don't know what I have. A roof, uh, structures, wood, roof. Hmm anything in here that isn't totally stupid 45 degree shack roof middle section with now that actually looks cool oh are these snap and build roofs 45 degree shack roof front left section front left section with window that's neat there's 25 degree ones and there's the 45 degree ones inner roof. So, well, that would snap like right here, wouldn't it? Wouldn't? Yeah. Oh! <laughs> I'm dying. <laughs> I'm sorry. Um, I've, I've never messed with these before. Hold on, let me go over to the 45 degree one. Middle section. How do I... Nah. Okay, well first let's let's start with what we would know. This would... Can, it, it, it's very janky with the rotations. So it keeps snapping to things. So it'd be like that. Um, no, I'm gonna get rid of those. Hold on. I've never messed with these roof types. That's cool. So that's 45 degree middle, middle section with window. That's so cool. I really like these pieces. Dude, I, lo I love this mod. At least I'm assuming this is from Snap and Build. Let's just mirror this on the other side. Wow, I could make way fancier buildings than I thought I could have. It's a damn shame. I don't know how often I'm going to visit this settlement, you know, with it being where it is. It makes me sad that I didn't do this with, like, with all my other settlements. Can you snap right here, please? What are you doing? Can you snap? On no, no. Can you, can you snap? Game. <laughs> game. Rotate. G game. It's not hard. You did it on the other side of the building. I hate this game. <laughs> <God damn it. laughs> oh god, don't make me laugh, I'll start choking. Alright, fuck you, you're going away. You, you, you can't be trusted. Where are the other 45 degree ones? I want the flat shack roof. I want the middle sections. Let's connect these. Dude, this is so cool. It actually looks like a house. Maybe if I get lucky and I can snap... It's like you see this is just freaking out. It just it can't make up its mind. There's like 20 different snap points, I guess, and it just it does not want to choose. Uh, um, <laughs> what's going on? But it does not want to snap to where you think it would snap. Here, here. Hey, <laughs> this may be a really cool looking roof, but. Uh, <laughs> the snapping is off on it. Stop laughing. I'm choking and dying. Allergies, please. Piss off. There we go. Oh, there we go. Okay, we're getting it. We're getting it. We're getting it. Okay, this one was supposed to be... Check roof. With the window. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh, God. I got it. I 
did it. Oh my god, I did it. I did it. I'm so proud. So there's the middle flash flat shack roof, which would snap right here. Yes, this looks like a building. Like this actually looks like something. I'm impressed. Now I gotta figure out how to close these off. So there were the front left windows. So there's this. So that would go like here. It would rotate and snap correctly. There you go. And I have to get the right one, which again that makes sense. So we'll put this on this side. I wish I wish I had these in the beginning, because these are just these are neat. These are like these are things that, I say this all the time when I have when I use these mods. These are stuff that the game should have just given you to start off with, but they didn't. I don't know about that snap. Yeah, it didn't snap to the right thing. I think that's better. Um. 45 degree shack roof front right section, so that's... I might need to put a wall here. I think I need to just straight up put a wall there. Uh, do do do, walls, let's see, wood walls, snap and build. No, see I need like some kind of tall piece. So, I guess that's under roof? I just missed it? Hmm, what would that be? What are you? Unless I'm just, you know, doing this wrong. I wonder if the taller walls from like the 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 warehouse set would work really well. I mean you could do something silly like this and then you could do Oh, I see what you could do. You could use that other like really funky shaped piece. Hold on, just out of curiosity, because I like to keep the square for some reason. Can I use Is there like a wooden wall under here? Maybe it'd be under barn. Mm, walls. Eh, I don't really know about any of these walls. They're kind of red. Huh. I'm getting a little ahead of myself here. I'm like, this is so cool. And then I don't have the pieces to complete it. Maybe I do, I just, I don't know. It's like, that. that's the perfect shape. But, uh, obviously the coloration is, is not what we want. So I need to figure out what piece we're using for that. So, let's go back. Mmm, do-do-do, wood roof might have to go outside see like what I could do something funky like this um if I didn't use this piece and then I use that funky angle piece thingy at the end here corner out or do we corner in uh, that okay uh <laughs> so janky I've never messed with any of this Really? I can't go through there? Damn it! I need to get outside to see what this stuff looks like. Okay. That's a little bit better. So it's all 45 degree crap. Mmm. So that's the corner in that I used, yes? Corner in right here. And then that matches up with the wall. Would it be, would it be, would it be the corner out? That would be the corner out. That wouldn't make any damn sense. What piece do I need for this? What piece do I need for this? It's a mystery. It's a goddamn mystery. I'm, I'm missing something incredibly obvious. I should stop messing with this before I drive people insane. Mm, I don't know. I don't know how I want to close this off. Tell you what, I'll just get rid of that. Get rid of that. I'll dig with this in a little bit. I want to go finish up some things to get the beds down. So we can maybe track some more people. And also not piss all of our settlers off. So, there you go. You snap there. I'll figure that out in a sec. Uh, wood wall. Close this up with a snap and build wall. But I really like that. I just need to figure out how to close it up correctly. Sweet. Now, do we want like a an actual bedroom? And we've done that sort of in the past. Uh, of course, you're not going to snap unless I pick a wall off. Get out of here, turret. I'm not even trying to select you. So if I do this, I don't know. Do I need to? Oh, I need to get rid of the the floor. All this to get, yeah, the snapping to work. Okay. Come on, put it back down. Nice. And then you can come back here, close that up. All I'm trying to do is make a doorway into like an actual bedroom. I think the easiest way to do it is to pick up the floor so we can get that snap back. Yeah. Gotta work within the confines of the system, huh? So let's go all the way back to the modular door frames because there's just no beating. There's no beating these. Like, 
This is just fantastic. This is such a clever idea, what they've done. Props to the, de the dev for this mod. Hell yes. I will cap it with no window, because this is supposedly a bedroom. Supposedly. Because now I need to put a shit ton of beds in here. Also, a door. So, back to structures, doors. Uh, you guys can have, let's see. Those are like metal doors. I don't think you'd be putting them in the center of your house. You guys can have a little white door. Yeah. Let's get you to snap. Okay. You guys have a door. I don't know if I'm going to, uh, <laughs> how I'm going to put a floor or like a roof on here. You know, like inside. I guess that's a problem for a little bit later, huh? Oh, shit. I didn't even think about that. But for now, let's get our beds. No, I'm not sucking anything. Let's get beds. I always use those beds. Like, these ones look way nicer, but the problem is they're huge in comparison. These beds fit way better in, in rooms. <laughs> uh, yeah, let's roll with this. You guys don't get any really fancy beds, I'm sorry. So, let's just line these beds. I wish there was a nicer way to keep these in order. Like, snapping and things like that. So that's seven beds, which means we're going to have 14 total if I follow the existing little pattern that I've got going on. Not that there's like a particular pattern, I just put seven over here. Four, five, six, and then we just need an extra bed here. And then let's space them out evenly is all I gotta do. So that's 14 beds, that almost takes care of this entire colony. Does not completely do it, but it's better than nothing. It's better than where we were at. And I can put some beds down the center, so that spaces things out nicely. I can even, instead of keeping them in line with that, I could do them this way. Let's see what that looks like, just down the center. Some beds. I gave them a pretty big bedroom, so I can get away with this. Right there. And here. So what are we at? 20 beds, which is good. Now if I up my charisma, we're going to get more people. But that's half decent. Not necessarily worried about extra settlers, because this is, this is good. So there we go. That's a cool little bedroom. I gotta get out of here. Neat. <laughs> I just have to figure out how to <laughs> close the hole in the wall. But I like that idea that they have like their own little bedroom up here. And I can put like carpet and flooring. I, I just think this is coming along way better. But I don't know how to close off this house. Because I've not worked with those pieces before. This is the first time I've ever even seen them. So we need roof, we need the flat shack roof. Those will snap here. Let's close this off. There you go. Uh, they are not rotated the same way. That's an easy fix. I'm just a little weird from the outside, but we won't really be seeing the outside too much. Rotate. Yep. And this is an overhang, right? No, no it's not. So how the hell am I supposed to close that off? Oh, there's actually like skylights. Dude, that's neat. <laughs> this mod. 45 degree shack corner, like I, I I just, I don't have a corner, you know, to this. I just wanted to cut it off like that. I don't, I don't know of the piece to do that. I'm not seeing the piece to do that, to be honest with you. I might just make make do and use the the barn wall i think it'd be easier to close it up because none of these walls are tall enough i don't think there's any short pieces that i can work with like half pieces i guess you could say yeah for now just to get it over with i know it's silly and it's stupid i'm gonna roll with this because i think if i don't use these pieces i'm gonna have to do something else to the roof design i kind of want to keep the roof design the way it is so this is not ideal. Definitely not. It's also a bit fun to attempt to finagle this. As best I can. Eh. Decent. <laughs> Let's go, go close this up. I don't know how I'm going to cover that up. That, uh, like the bedroom. I don't know. I don't think they ever really intended you to... Uh, only on the roof of the house to do that. Ray right about... There. Looks decent, right? Half decent. Not ideal, but 
I love how we're getting some natural light from that. Kind of coming in here. Dude, I could put like a skylight up there if I wanted to, but they already have... They already have free light coming through there. I mean, I feel like this was meant to be upper floor, but I'm totally taking creative liberties with this. Do I want to put a wall in here? Ooh, I just thought of something. With those pieces down here, the angled pieces... Do they fit? Oh no, 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 that's all I want to do. Do they fit within the confines, like what I'm trying to go for? Nah, not really. Nah. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know. What I could do, because you never see the roof. Wood, walls. Let's go snap and build. And... Oh god. <laughs> it's, like, it's freaking out here. Are you not going to snap to that? You son of a biscuit. Ah, oh, man, I wanted to have a... I wanted to have a bedroom in there, but I can't get that to quite work. Here, we'll put that outside. That's up on the roof. Uh, I can store these. I'll put those up top. I need to go on the roof. Defense is too low. Ah, it's fine. They'll be okay. So this looks really freaking cool, but I don't know how to close that off correctly. So they have all the beds they need. They have all the crafting stations that I could ever want. And because, really, jetpack, I hate... Sometimes I really hate my jetpack. Like, I feel like it just doesn't work the way it used to. Sometimes. I could just be crazy. Probably crazy. Uh, yeah. I, I have essentially the basics at this point. Okay. I need turrets up top here. There's a wealth of technology. And if I put the turret on the edge, it's got a very good vantage point. Put the turret over there, it's got a very good vantage point. I put... Am I walking through that? Wow. That's a... That's worrisome. There's no bounding box on that. There's no physics applied to it. That's strange. No, 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 no turn it back on. I didn't mean to turn it off. I meant to pick it up. Here. Snap to the ground. You guys can stay up here. I certainly hope nobody shoots you. But let's put some defense up top. Uh, some regular old turrets in case the power goes out. I have six of these to work with. Hmm. Sure, I'll put them in the window. So now th these are s these are technically floating because there's no bounding box on those. That's kind of janky, but that's okay. Now I'll put some rocket turrets on this building for sure. I mean, hell, I already have a uh, I have a, this very very nice flat plane to work with, so it'll be easy to put like generators and things up here. I'll th I'll do that for sure. Rocket turrets have just earned a place in my heart <laughs> for settlement defense. After witnessing them in action. It's hard to be disappointed. So missile turrets. I call them rocket turrets, but missile. Hmm. Like corner, like this kind of thing? They have a really good vantage point. They have a really good angle and everything. Yeah, let's go with that. I'll power them up and make sure our defensive value is really, really strong for this place. I think I'll still put some more turrets down, maybe even on top of the the greenhouse. I don't know where we're going to uh, get attacked from. I have no idea. I've never seen this place you know, come under attack, but... Oh, we need to figure that out. So, what's the center piece here? This is the center tile, I believe. And since this is supposedly the center tile, I'll put rocket turrets in the middle, too. So we have rocket turrets on each corner, and then in the center, and then on each one of those little windows, we have normal turrets. So if the power ever got knocked out, we still have some defense, but I... I don't think anything's going to have a chance to knock out the power here. Or pretty much die instantly. So, connectors and switches. Uh, first up, let's just link these. Um, link. Okay, I did link those, dir. Link you. What? Generator, get out of the way. Link you. And it's going to be hard to, like, hide a power generator up here and not have it get shot. It'd be really easy to put power inside the house and wire it up through the floor. I've done that a million times before, and that works out really well. I could even hide, means I could even hide this generator. I like that idea. This might be a bit cheese, but let's do it. So, just break you. Okay, um... I really want to find out how I can close this off. I don't think there's a great way to do it. Maybe if I put, no, shack floor. So, I mean, I could do that. You never really know. N Ooh. Hmm. Hold on. Hold on. Slight idea. 
slight idea. Wood floor. Do shack floor. I guess I have to do the shack upper floor for that to get the snap. Damn it. Wood floor. I always forget. So it's so silly. Yeah, so I'll have to start this way. And then let's rotate you over here. Come on, I saw you snap. I I, I know what well, well, I, I don't know where that went. I know you're, I know you're capable of snapping over here. God damn it, game. You ha have it your way then. <laughs> Start our snapping this way. So what this will look like, I mean, you're not going to see the light from in the bedroom. But this is mostly just to make the house look cool from the outside, I guess. And then I could put a power bank up here. Like where I'm standing, above the beds. Sure, they're, you know, they're never going to get a nice night's sleep. Seem really noisy, but at least they're alive, right? <laughs> That's something to be happy about, I suppose. Uh, I'll, I'll wire the power strip to the floor. So, one of these generators would be more than enough to power everything. But remember, these use an absurd amount of resources. I mean, I could put a few regular generators over here, and I would do it, but. I still think it'd be really cool to have, like, a fusion generator. That's kind of going through the floor a bit. But that might work in my favor. And what I mean is as follows. Let's do this. Um, connect the power first. Maximum cheese, remember. And then let's rotate you. Like that. Spacebar, please. Don't grab the wire. Don't grab the. Don't grab the wire. And let's cover you up. <laughs> None the wiser. Uh, I don't. I don't, I don't know if it's grabbing the wire. Tab. Stop. Stop grabbing wire. Damn it. <laughs> I'll do. It. I'll do it this way. Uh, you now have power, and because you have power, you can power all of these easily. Uh, that's not gonna work. So that is a bit scary, because that makes this thing a super easy target. It's a bit of a central hub, but... Eh. I think it looks kind of cool, to be fully honest with you. Even enough to, like, do this. This is defeating the point, I guess. No, 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 yeah, you. you. Connect to that. So everything has power. Um, I'll keep those lined up. I mean, if I did this, I have redundancy. I should do this. Here, you need to come up top. This is a mess. I know. But it's a fun mess. It's a very fun mess. Okay. Cover you up. I don't want to see you no more. <laughs> it's so messy, but I'll never see it. That's the fun part. 122 defense. I could totally go higher than that, but... As I've seen with these rocket turrets, they are not to be screwed with. That is good enough. So this building may not look as great as I want it to look inside. But outside, I'm not sure what... I think that's a shack upper floor coming through. Right there. That's a bit annoying. I wonder if it does that on the other side. Because I don't see it here. Maybe I didn't snap it correctly. We come up top here. We have our little fusion generator set up. I could even make a staircase up here and store stuff up there. That would be pretty cool, too. But, like... We got a bedroom, we got a power generation set up, we have defense on the roof, we have a fancy looking roof compared to like what I've had in the past and everything being perfectly squared off. I have a, a merchant center, a crafting station thing, a big old farm out here that I can start manipulating. I haven't even touched that, that's 26 food that this place has always had. None of this is stuff that I've messed with. This is just food that's been here before I got here. That's pretty cool. I like the way that building looks, I think that looks really cool. I guess I should start slapping some lights in here. Yeah, buddy! That's a good time to wrap it up, guys. So I'm going to go ahead and do just that. Episode 522. Thank you guys all for watching, and I'll see you next time.